very few people turn on their Xbox to stare at the dash. People turn on their Xbox to go play games, and I think us having a strong first party at Xbox means when I think about Xbox, I'm going to think about quality games. We have work to do there. We haven't done our best work over the last few years with our first party output. I'm yeah, that's all that. What's going on, everybody? This is Dirt Griggity with a brand new blah, blah, blah. Who gives a shit? All aboard the Xbox hate train. Yes, there are so many people that jumped onto the Xbox hate train that it's absolutely ridiculous. But listen, Phil Spencer just did this interview with Fortune. And I posted a, a clip at the beginning of this video where Phil has pretty much said how Xbox first party has a lot of work to do. Now, this isn't the first time that Phil Spencer came out and said this. He admitted it before that, yes, our first party is underwhelming and we have a lot of work to do. Now, of course, when Phil said this, people just automatically bashing. People that's on the Xbox hate train, like, this is bullshit. Did he say this before? He said this before and there are still no games. Xbox exclusives is still trash. And he said this before, so Phil is full of shit. Yes, I've seen people say this before. But I look at it like this. The first step in fixing the problem is first admitting that you have a problem. That's the first step. How many of us know some big people, some fat people? I know some fat people personally in my life. And I remember this chick I used to know. She said, you know what? I'm not really fat. I'm, listen, I'm, I'm a little thick. I'm a little chunky. I'm big boned. Or, or, or you'll see somebody say, yeah, I'm a little big because my mom's big. My dad's big. My aunties are big. No, I went to lunch with your ass. You big because you eat too damn much. So, admitting the problem is the first step. Phil Spencer admitted the problem. Now, the difference between when he said it before to now is there's proof that they're trying to fix this problem. There's proof. Acquiring new studios is proof, is it not? But now, people on the Xbox Hate Train are telling me that all of the studios besides 343 Coalition and uh, Playground Games are going to be doing double-A games. Yes, people are saying even the Initiative Ninja Theory is all going to be doing double-A games. Now, these new studios, of course, some of them are going to be doing double-A games. I believe Double Fine Studios will probably do a very polished double-A game. Compulsion Games may be the same. But who the hell knows? Maybe they're going to do a, double, a, a triple-A game. I don't know. But the point is, these people on this Xbox hate train just constantly try to find ways to make everything Phil Spencer say, everything Xbox, a negative. Yes, this hate tree, I'm sorry, this hate train thing is real. Everything is negative. No matter what. So yeah, we all know uh, I'm an Xbox guy. I'm not a, a, a biggest, the biggest fan in the world of Phil Spencer. I don't love the guy, but I don't think he's bad either, as bad as people make him seem to be. I don't think he's like the worst thing for Xbox. People don't like the direction Xbox is headed. That's fine. Me personally, I don't give a shit. You know, but these Xbox haters, they definitely have an agenda and they're going to stick to their agenda. Bashing Xbox is the thing to do. So all aboard that Xbox hate train, y'all. I am about to get out of here, though. If you like this video, please hit the like button. If you happen to stumble upon my channel, you think I'm decent enough, why don't you subscribe? All right, everybody. Peace and love. Peace and love.